Now this is the most basic and fundamental chapter of chemistry which forms the basis of most of the chemistry. The beauty of this chapter is it does not involve too many formulas. There are just few concepts which you have to use intelligently. The first question is we have a gaseous alkane and unknown alkane which is exploded with oxygen. The moles of oxygen which is required for complete combustion and the CO2 formed they are in the ratio of 7 is to 4. We need to find out the formula of that unknown alkane. Now as you know that alkane is represented by Cn H2N plus 2. And when they are treated with oxygen they give carbon dioxide and water. So let us assume our alkane is Cn H2N plus 2. In order to deduce the formula of alkane we need to find what is N. So let us write the equation as lambda into Cn H2N plus 2 plus X times oxygen gives Y times CO2. We do not know N, so we do not know the stoichiometric coefficients of the alkane, the oxygen and CO2. So we assume them to be lambda, X and Y. Now we are given X upon Y is equal to 7 upon 4. So X upon 7 is equal to Y upon 4 let us assume this to be equal to k. So, x equals 7k and y equals 4k. So, let us rewrite the equation as lambda into Cn H2N plus 2 plus 4k or rather 7k times oxygen yielding 4k times CO2. Now, this is an equation which involves carbon, hydrogen and oxygen. Let us write water also in order to balance the hydrogen. Now we see that the oxygen on the left hand side are 7k into 2 which is 14k. So the oxygen towards the right should also be equal to 14k. Here we have 4k into 2 that is 8k. So here the oxygen should be 6k. So we rewrite the whole equation as lambda into Cn H2N plus 2 plus 7K oxygen giving 4K CO2 plus 6K water. We have got this 6K because here we had 14K oxygen, here we had 4 into 2 into K that is 8K. So, here we multiplied this water with 6K. Now, balancing the number of carbon, we get lambda into n is equal to 4k. This is our first equation. And balancing the hydrogen, we get lambda into 2n plus 2 is equal to 6k into 2, which is equal to 12k. Now, dividing both the equations, we get 2n plus 2 upon n is equal to 12 upon 4 which is equal to 3. So, we get 3n is equal to 2n plus 2. Hence, our n is equal to 2. We have got the n. So, putting n here, we get the alkane as C2H6 which is our ethane. Hence, our final answer is the alkane is ethane having the formula C2H6.